Cincinnati Zoo has enjoyed many days off the grid for more than a decade after the zoo's first solar array was installed over the main parking lot. Yeah, but now they're setting even bigger goals to become net zero by 2025. I need somebody to explain all this stuff to me. So we've got <laughs> WLWT News 5's Adam Berniston here now with details on how they're going to achieve this sustainability goal. Yeah, Mike and Ashley, this is a big uh, leap for the zoo out there. Now that they are uh, it, making ground or breaking ground earlier this month on this new uh, whole new solar array that will cover their Euclid Avenue parking lot, providing not only shade to the car and buses, but also even more power to the zoo and surrounding community. This project comes online a little around two thirds of our power will come from our parking lots. And in 2030, 2032, I have some other shenanigans rolling around in the back of my head, will be 100%. Since installing their original solar array back in 2011, the Cincinnati Zoo has already been able to reach several financial goals. But now this new addition will provide nearly double the amount of renewable energy. So in 2005, we used $1.6 million in utilities. Since then, our sewer rates have tripled. Our square foot of buildings have gone up 60%, right? doubled our attendance, and yet our energy bills have been cut in half. Along with saving money, the Cincinnati Zoo is also leading the way on sustainability by producing green energy. It'll be equivalent to planting 66,000 tree seedlings and letting that grow for 10 years and doing that Every year, the solar array is in operation for the next 30 years. And with this new solar array addition, they've made a commitment not only increasing their own sustainability, but to help more communities become greener while also helping lower their electric bills. We ordered additional panels, uh, and it's a significant amount, that will be deployed in Avondale, East Price Hill, Bond Hill, etc., to again invest the same beautiful renewable asset into underserved communities that need help. Now, the zoo's sustainability efforts don't just stop within city limits. The zoo's 600 acres, acre solar farm in Warren County is the largest in southwest Ohio. That renewable energy will be brought, bought by companies in the region to help them reach their own sustainability goals as well. Meteorologist Adam Bernison, WLWT News 5.